WTFNN. Headline News Update. Hi folks, Basil Chapman here on this fourth day of October, Monday, and we're looking at the, the E-mini right now. You can see down 60. He has the 10-minute chart, made this uh, fourth highest peak, peak D, earlier on on Friday, and then went sideways, and then boom, goes down, and then went sideways for a long time, holding the 200-period moving average, went to this uh, peak right here at 43, just above 43.40, and now we're trading at 42.82 down sharply. So let's go through the numbers. You can see that the Dow right here has had a very sharp pullback. Uh, it's, let me get rid of that because we know more long. We just had it as a trade. Uh, and now you've got this uh, sandwich. You've got the red Thursday, big green uh, Friday, red uh, Monday. And this is not good because 33.785 is key support. Break that and 33.600 uh, is the next test. So there has to be a move into the 34,600s by Wednesday or Thursday. That's going to be tough to do. S&P is down sharp. The Dow's down 411 at 33,914. S&P's down 65 at 42.92. Gone to a lower low than Friday. You don't like to see that. If you're looking at the QQQ, the NDX 100, a whopper of a move down, down 2.3%, down 8.3 at 351.84, way below Friday's low. Uh, for subscribers to my opening call, we, we, we should be pleased. It's not a thing you want to be pleased about, but fortunately, we are short way, way back from just after the top. Uh, we're looking at the IWM, the Russell 2000, trading down almost three at 219.36. It's in a trading range. Talk about a trading range, we're looking at gold. Gold is now up nine at 17.67. It's attempting to become a moment of focus as there is weakness everywhere. Will, will money flow into gold? Will it push into the 1790-1805 area? We'll be watching this very closely. Crude oil, crude oil with all that bad news over the weekend, the oil spill is up 210 at 78, breaking to a new recovery high. Uh, it's got key support in the 72 to 71 area. And this is at 77.99. This is a big move to the upside. T bonds, the TLT, the Lehman 20 year Treasury bond fund, down 34 cents. It just can't find strength. And that means that the yields are going higher and the yields are helping some areas like the financials. But I have to tell you something inflation, they can't deny it. I mean, it's right there staring you in the face. Folks, to staring you in the face is Larry Pesavento coming up in his new time. You're coming back up in a moment for his show starting at 11 o'clock on 11.05. And stay tuned. And then think or swim. Steve Rhodes, Kate White, Tom O'Brien coming up. Great program. Check out the opening for my daily newsletter. Have a wonderful day. See you The reality 